Tokyo, January 10th, 1935. Councillor Yiri Zharkovsky, member for Czechoslovakia of the IOC. Dear Sir, during the 10th Olympiad at Los Angeles, I had the honor to present an invitation from the mayor of Tokyo to hold the 1940 Olympiad in Tokyo and to express my own opinion urging its acceptance. After that, I have availed myself of every opportunity to persuade the members of the IOC that Tokyo is looking forward with keen interest to the pleasure of welcoming the 12th Olympiad of 1940. A few days ago, I received a letter from the mayor of Tokyo asking me to do my best to secure your favorable consideration of Tokyo's earnest desire to have the 12th Olympiad. I herewith enclose the English translation of the mayor's letter. As you may know, the year of 1940 falls on the 2600th anniversary of the foundation of the Japanese Empire. National celebration of the Empire's 2600th anniversary would attract far more spectators than at any other time, because we can expect millions of visitors to Tokyo from both in and outside of the country at that time. For this reason, if for no other, 1940 is the time of all times to hold the 12th Olympiad in Tokyo. Some may object to the selection of Tokyo as an Olympic city because of its remoteness and consequent increase in traveling expenses. But you can, however, see from the mayor's letter to me that as a countermeasure, the Tokyo city authorities have recently passed a bill subsidizing to the extent of 1 million yen the traveling expenses of the Olympic competitors to Japan. If Tokyo is chosen for 1940, moreover, we can promise every facility and convenience in 1940. Since the inauguration of the International Olympic Games, they have been held only in Europe and America, but to our great regret, never in Asia which has nearly one half of the world's inhabitants. I believe that athletic interest is now worldwide and that Japan has shown sufficient loyalty to the Olympic spirit and athletic ability since her participation to the games to commend the confidence of the IOC. If Tokyo be selected as host to the 12th Olympiad of 1940, the true spirit of the International Olympic Games will spread over the Asia as well as in Europe and America. I beg herewith to ask you your powerful influence to realize Japan's earnest and long cherished desire. I remain, sir, yours sincerely, Jigoro Kano, member for Japan of the IOC. P.S. I intended to be present myself at the coming conference at Oslo, but I am sorry to say that my physical condition prevents me from doing so. Count Mr. Soeshima, who was appointed a member of the IOC in place of the late Dr. Kishi, has already left Japan for Oslo, and Dr. Sugimura, Japanese ambassador to Italy, will perhaps also attend the conference. I shall deem it a great favor if you will kindly extend to them your generosity as you have always done to me.